Hi, Tina and uh, Christine. Um, today, I want to share with you this uh, showing that we have on the house. Uh, right here, you see about 20 showings, um, which is not bad at all. Usually, though, um, if we have about 10 showing within the first week, we probably get the house under contract. But these 20 showings, you know, it's been is is spread out for about two months now, and that's why we don't have anything in contract. And obviously, um, uh, it's telling us that the price is a little too high. And actually, uh, for a few feedback that we have from all this uh, showing, uh, they are saying that uh, the price is a little too high. And um, you know, at the beginning, I was saying that. Um, for my, you know, personal and professional opinion, the house is probably about eight forty, and um, but but then uh, Christine was saying um, she wanted for eight fifty, which I think is very possible, and but in the end we do it eight eighty because well Tina wanted eight eighty, and again I I would I I said that it was a little too high. And, you know, um, but now that we know that is actually too high now that we have all this showing and uh, uh, the house is not under contract yet. So, um, so I guess as you can see right here, um, not that we don't have any showing, we have we do have a lot of showing, but unfortunately, uh, nothing in hand. But again, I don't know. Um, if uh, you're willing to lower the price, but at this point, I believe it's very obvious that um, the price is a little higher than um, um, than the market is willing to pay for, and um, and and I don't know. I mean, um, there are costs involved that you know you want to get the house in the market like this because. Each month, I believe, is cost you around five thousand dollars, right? Tax, insurance, uh, electricity, uh, and all that other fee involved, um, plus your mortgage. So I'm, I think it's it's, it's close to five thousand dollars. It see now it's almost two months. That ten thousand dollars, right? With all this anxiety, I don't know. I don't know if you are willing to give it up until the. I I believe you know in in, in the late spring the house um the price is gonna move up a little bit, but late spring more people are gonna put the house put the house on the market and more competition. So I am not sure if that's the good thing. But then by then a few more months it will cost you. You know, another ten, fifteen thousand uh, dollars. If we can sell at the price that we want, then, then, then you know, we still is still the house right now is only worth like what, um, a fifty, a sixty-five. Well, that is if we can sell the house at the price that we want. But now, uh. Because the house has been on the market for this long, by then even if we can sell the house, I think the minimum people are gonna ask is gonna be like ten, fifteen thousand dollars for their closing costs. I mean, if by then think about it, by then we get a contract like that, we cannot just walk away, right? I mean, we 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 want to let it go. I I don't know if you are willing to walk away, but most people like myself and a lot of people that I know, at that time. When we see a contract, we're kind of desperate to let is to to work on it, and and so I I I don't know how much longer you're willing to hold on to this property and try to sell it at the prices you want, but the market has spoke for itself, um, and unusually, you know, my my evaluation because I don't use computer like all the a lot of all the agent do. Um, I actually do comparison like I, in the video that you you saw that I did before. So the number is pretty close to um, uh, 
to what the house should be worth. Uh, because I look at the square footage, I look at the condition, and uh, by basically by looking at so many houses, I know the condition of the home. For example, for Catherine, uh, when she saw the house is right next to her house, on the other, just just right behind her house. Um, in the pictures, I mean, they look pretty nice. They took pretty nice pictures, and um, it was so far. I don't know. I mean, three eighty or ninety, ninety five, some something around there. And she texted me saying that it's it's kind of concerning. So I went back to look at the pictures, and I realized, yeah, the picture looked nice, but the house is not as good. And I told her that she shouldn't be concerning. And um. So we still put the house on four thirty five, and within that weekend, actually, I put it on the market on um, Wednesday evening, and uh, by Friday we have a contract already. So, um, by the weekend we have a, a few more showing, but no contract. But but again, uh, by Friday we already have the contract. So even though Catherine House is a lot, I mean. She kind of concerned that we might not be able to sell at the prices we want, but we did. Um, and by looking at by doing like that, I mean I'm I'm correct more often than I am not. And on this house, I mean I mean if if we were to do like a forty a fifty, like Christine was asking, uh, we should have gone through settlement already. I really believe in that, but now though, even if we reduce the price, they might still try to, you know, push us down some more. So now we actually run into a much, you know, bigger problem than than just reducing the price that we used to want. Um. So, but again, uh, again, I wanna I wanna share with you some of the houses that. Has been sold in the past, you know, six months, like this one right here, seven seventy four. Look at this. I mean, the picture is is not that nice, but they have this garage door right here. Look at this garage door. It's obviously newer than us, right? Uh, they don't have much of a landscaping. This is in the summer, so not much we can say about it. the 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 their roof is pretty nice. But look at the windows. This is the same windows as we have on our house. They probably already upgraded the door right here. I think, I think this door is newer, or m maybe more stylish. There, yeah, it is newer, and they replaced the floor right here already. This bathroom, I'm, I'm sorry, this bathroom is old, right from this angle right here, the cabinet. But this door, they've been replacing all this. This doors already. Look at this door right here. So the doors ha uh I mean have been already been replaced. They have hardwood floor. Look at that. Right? Uh these I am not sure. We don't have this door. But um obviously they open it up, go to the back here. Uh, I couldn't. I couldn't tell for sure, but it's. It doesn't look like it's the original door. It's been replaced, but it doesn't look that new either. Um, it's hardwood floor. I mean, you can see this. This setting. The setting of this house is almost exactly like yours, right? Uh, the stage. Whoever stayed this house doesn't look as good as the one that we have, and the picture is not. As good either. I don't know for some reason it's kind of blurry on my computer. Maybe my computer, but um, look at that. Uh, it's not bad. They have some kind of crown molding and chair rail. Uh, but you can see now that it's look almost exactly like your house. Well, except for the hardwood floor is the older hardwood floor, and uh, this windows right here is doesn't look like it's the original window like we have. It's been replaced, but years ago. Uh, the kitchen that granite countertop basically is very comparable to the kitchen that we have, and uh, as you can see right there, the appliance. Yeah, it's just almost the same. Um, at this angle right here, we have just a barely like a. A bar right here, not even a bar. Some some kind of wall they have, they built into uh, like a bar, I guess. And they have this island right here. So and that's house 
And this house, guess what? It was so in August, right? Which is right after we bought our house for seven seventy four. Um. And uh, and then for this house, seven seventy four. And this house would just recently went on the market, and they went under contract for seven sixty five. And uh, look at the uh, look at this house right here. Uh, well, the roof, right? By looking at the roof, we know that this house roof is very similar to our house right here. So is the garage door. Uh, yeah, this door right here is very similar to our doors right here. So the inside, obviously, our house is better because they have carpet, and this is. Uh, Pargo, right? Carpet, uh, carpet. Well, this house is not bad, but basically it's carpet. The, so it's the same kind of um, you know bathroom that we have here. I think they been they replaced it somehow. They replaced the faucet. I don't know if they replaced the door, just painted like we did. Uh, they probably replaced the cabinet too. This is the newer cabinet because you don't see the hinge that attached to the outside. Um, the basement pretty nice. They um, they have ceramic in the basement, and we have vinyl. No, not this is not the basement. This is the first floor, the main floor because the kitchen right here. Um, uh, that's to go upstairs. The garage door. Um, no, this is the basement. Right here. So that. I don't know where that will go to. Probably to the storage. Um, so, but overall, you can see that this house, um, oh, it's not as nice as we have, obviously, and it's it's only so for for obvious reasons, seven sixty five, and look at the square footage is taxable, is two thousand and thirty nine, right. Um, so, and it's only so for this much, right? And look at the one that is selling for 825, 874, 825. Look at this 825 right here, right? Uh, it's a different kind of styles right here. But look at, look at this house. Um, they have a much more modern door right here. Uh, they replace this, the door, new paint, uh, new remodel bathroom, the kitchen, um, they have the island here and here, I don't know, it's, the picture is not very clear, I couldn't say, but they have the deck right there, the windows, it looks like the window has been replaced and the door, sliding door too, see, um, and, well, the the I don't know how new the cabinet is white and 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 I couldn't say, but it's pretty modern. It's been remodeling um, recently, and they have all these appliances there. Right, we don't. Um, they have the deck out there, right from the kitchen going out. Okay, so it's 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 pretty nice. They have some hardwood floor here too. Um, Look at that. Um, this is in the basement, I believe. And this house right here is like that, right? Um, in the bedroom, they have carpet in the bedroom. Um, the bathroom right here, the closet. So it's not bad. They've been remodeling a lot of these stuff, right? And the house was only sold for eight twenty five. It was asking for eight fifty at the beginning, but then, but then uh, it's been so long. It's been on the market for like I don't know, it's a long time. In the end, um, it sold for eight twenty five. And look at the square footage of this house right here. Is obviously it's sell for. Uh, it's, it's almost 600 square feet bigger than our house, right? By looking at this, we know. 
uh, because if you look at our house right here um, the um, taxable square foot is 21 right here we see all this number uh, this number is actually incorrect right uh, but I chance is because Christine I mean uh, Tina or oh, wanted to show like that um, but but this is the county is looking at to tax the house right here which is not including the basement just the first two floor uh, and uh, and basically by looking at all this and and look at the 886 right here I mean how are we going to care to this house right here well actually this is not a detached this is um, uh, but it's look like this house is in a different community, right? So it's not even, there is not even a road. So this is within the community right here. Um, but as you can see by looking at all this house, I mean, 880, uh, it's obviously way too high. Uh, even right now, if we're looking at this house right here, well, we obviously, um, the interior of our house is obviously better than this house, but uh, this house is bigger, right? Twenty-seven, and the total finish is, as you can see right here, thirty-eight, not thirty-one. And um, this house right here for seven forty-four, but if we look at this, the square footage is very comparable to one that we have which is you know say again the first number is this and this and then the total square fit is right there uh, that is the correct way to um show the house though um but again they were able to sell the house for 774 uh and this right here 765 but obviously our house right now and this is um well this is about a hundred square feet smaller. Um hundred or two. Um uh, but the condition is not bad at all. Um but that they were selling for like a hundred and fifteen thousand below what we want for our house. And this house right here is bigger, it's twenty seven hundred thirty three. Um so, but this, look at this house, it's really nice right here. Uh, yeah. Um, well, the kitchen is very comparable to our house right here. Well, look at this. Uh, they have new windows, new doors. Um, yeah, and yeah, so, <clears throat> again, um, I don't know how long you want to keep the house at this price right here is just gonna cost us more money uh, cost you more money um, but I truly believe um, you know a around a 40 a 50 is the right price um, but again you know um, um, but right now a 80 the market has already spoken that they're not gonna pay for that much so anyway, I hope that this will help you in, uh, you know, making your decision. Um, I know the anxiety and everything is probably up on the roof right now. I mean, through the roof already. So really think about it. Is uh, the more we gonna keep it like this, it's gonna cost you more. And I don't know what else I can say to help you make. The be the right the, I mean the right decision. But uh, obviously, you know, this uh, this telling us very clearly.